everyone, I'm uh, Harm Weiters, I'm from uh, Wacom.nl, uh, we're a big web shop over in Holland. We're doing uh, kind of a lot of, uh, we're doing quite a lot of things with Docker, um, and yes, obviously using Prometheus to take care of metrics, um, with Alert Manager in place to alert us, and Grafana uh, to just display information uh, whenever we want it. So. All services have a metrics endpoint. Uh, you really don't get to go to production or even acceptance or even dev if you don't have metrics. So yeah, if you want to keep the S3 team happy, you want to have a metrics endpoint. And this was pretty much mandatory when we started. So over the past couple of years, everyone grew accustomed to having metrics. How it all works, we've got, basically it comes down to ownership Every team is fully responsible for their own um, code, for their own software, for their own service. Um, getting alerts in is simple using regular GitHub workflows, um, where you'd have uh, regular pushes, pull requests, and merge. Uh, merge is being done. Uh, eventually, a console would pick up the new configuration. Console template would notify Prometheus and Alert Manager, and bam, there you have it, a new alert in production and we figured well this is all pretty nifty pretty handy what if we can do more so we figured well let's let's move these alerts onto a kafka queue write a bunch of consumers to do arbitrary stuff and there you have it you no longer get to uh, get woken up to do silly actions you just have the consumer take uh, well take control essentially um, so this is pretty powerful, um, just pushing alerts onto Kafka where they can be consumed by just about any consumer you can write. So you can have uh, situations like this, arbitrary metrics giving you some kind of insights and you'd, you'd really like a thread dump being made for whatever reason. Write an exporter, I'm uh, oh, sorry, write a consumer that'll do that. Or raising a debug level, just write any consumer and it'll uh, upgrade the lock level for this particular service. And if shit's really hitting the fan, just write a <laughs> consumer for Domino's. <laughs> so in the end, we're going pretty strong with, with SRE. And this is uh, really taking, well, it's taking a, a little bit of the burden away by automating silly actions. Uh, which means extra bedtime. Um, but if you're playing al along with SRE, you also have SLO, SLI, and SLAs, which means you don't ever lose the incentive of actually going in and fixing your code, because it simply will show up on your uh, error budget. And the real power is this is all being done, uh, being driven by regular alert manager queries, regular prompt QL stuff that we've all uh, started learning two years ago, and everyone knows this. That's it. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>